Hello friends, welcome back to another video. You are watching Take Look YouTube channel, and in this video, we are solving second unit of the Shield Platform Encryption module. Let's get start with the new video. To solve the challenge, we need to select a new playground. That's why select new playground and click on the launch button. After that, we need to solve the some uh, prerequisites assignments. That is uh, assign permission and uh, another one is uh, create a tenant secret. For that, uh, first of all, we need to assign permissions. Let's click on the gear icon here and open the setup option. And here we have successfully opened our org that is setup org. After that here is a quick find box. Just search for the permission sets. And after that click on permission sets. Here we need to create a new permission sets for the users. And the name is a key manager. Now go back into our org and click on the new button. After that paste our copy name that is key manager and uh, api automatically selected by the system now just scroll down and uh, you will get a system permission option just click on that and open it after that opening click on the edit button here we need to select uh, two check boxes just scroll down and in the c list here you can see c options from c options we need to select a customized application just check the checkbox and after that we need to scroll down again and go into m section and here you will get one option that is uh, uh, manage encryption keys just uh, click on the checkbox uh, before that manage encryption keys here you can see uh, we have successfully checked all the checkboxes. Now just click on the save button. After saving, you will get one message, and uh, for after getting that message, just click on the save button again. And here you can see we have successfully get that message and click on the save button. Now we need to assign uh, our permission sets to users. For that, just uh, find for the users into quick find box and after that open the users now we need to assign our permission set to our existing user that is system administrator now just uh, search for the system administrator and click on the our name click on the full name after opening the user just scroll down and here we will get permission set assignments option just click on the edit assignments here basically we need to assign our permission set that uh, key manager permission set for that uh, here is a button edit assignment just click on that and now uh, from the list uh, just select for the key manager that is here you can see key manager and click on the add button after that here is a save button just click on the save button and we have successfully assigned our permission set to user after that we need to generate a tenant secret key for that we need to search for the platform encryption in the quick find box so copy that text and go back into our org and here is a quick find box just paste our platform encryption text and from that uh, select for the key management now click on the generate tenant secret option Here you can see uh, there is a one button that is export just click on that and click on the ok button. Now again go into quick find box and just for uh, search for platform encryption and click on the encryption policy. Now you will get an encryption policy. After that here is a small link that is uh, encrypt fields just click on that link. And here you'll get a object option just click on the edit button and basically in that uh, we need to select the fields from the our object and here you can see we have some uh, object there and from object we need to select uh, like from the account we need to select a billing address and after that uh, from the contact we need to select a name just uh, go into again 
our org and here you can see in the contact object there is a name field just check the check boxes and after that in uh, case here you can see case we need to select for the subject uh, here you can see here is a subject field just click on the check box button and after selecting all the check boxes just here is a save button just click on that save button now we have successfully completed our challenge just check our challenge for that just click on the check challenge button and uh, if you are new on the channel please try to subscribe channel because here we will get 100% solution of the latest trailhead modules for the next challenge just go into description you will get a next video link thanks for watching